after being blessed by the herb's essence, I'm back to my rest, <laughs> 10 minutes, some odd seconds. That's where I got the honey at, spends the night for sex and keep lubrication, lifestyle protection. Very good. <laughs> Hi, I'm Archie. I'm Molly. And today we're finally gonna do uh, Illmatic by Nas. So for those who haven't uh, seen our uh, greatest albums video, um, this is my favorite rap album of all time. So I'm excited to share this with you. Yeah, we've been meaning to do this for a long time. Yeah, I just, I don't know, I don't know. We just kept, <laughs> we just kept putting it in the back burner. I know it's kind of cliche to say this is like the the best rap album of all time. Um, but I genuinely, I genuinely love this album. It's like my, it is my favorite. I've said in that video also that like, it's kind of a gift and a curse to, mm -hmm. to have this as my favorite because it's, I like, especially in the 2000s, I was measuring every album to this. And if it didn't make that standard, then it wasn't good enough. Yeah. And then, so it's, it wasn't until later on where I was just, I was more open. This was released in 1994. Mm -hmm. He made this when he was 19 years old. Oh shit. So I just keep that in mind. Oh wow. Yeah. He's probably my favorite rapper of all time. I think it was the first rap album to really have different producers, mm -hmm. like different top tier producers. Like before this album, I think there was always one producer, one in-house producer that was um, in charge of all the beats on this on the album mm -hmm. whereas in this one he got legendary producers also um a lot of these rappers and even like outside of rap like they start putting baby pictures and like <laughs> pictures of them as kids on their album covers like Nas was the first one to do that oh wow yeah so if you think about like uh like drake has one where you know his mm -hmm. head in the clouds yeah and there's like lil wayne uh notorious big like mm -hmm. shortly after that uh, you've heard one song i think yeah I know the world is the, yours. The world is yours. Yeah, yeah, you listen to that quite a lot. Yeah. Um, yeah, I know that one. I yeah. think that's the only one I know. I guess the the only challenge or one of the challenges of reviewing a, uh, an album from 1994 is like the slang. Yeah, that was before I was born. Yeah. So uh, <laughs> so there's going to be some words that you're not probably going to know. Well, you said to me once, if there's anything in a rap song that you don't understand, it has numbers, it's probably a gun. Yeah. <laughs> So <laughs> anyway, I've I've spoken at great length. Uh, I think it's time to Let's get into jump it. in. Yeah. Okay. So the first one is called Genesis, which is an intro, and okay. then we'll let it play into New York State of Mind. Okay. Okay. You're sitting at home doing this shit, and you should be on a medal for this. Stop fucking around and be a man. This. Oh. Yo, Nas. Yo, what the fuck is this bullshit on the radio, son? Chill, chill. That's the shit, God. Chill. Hey, yo, yo, pull out and shave, man. Let's count this money, nigga. Hey, yo, Nas, put the jacks, put the grass over there. You know what I'm saying? Because we right, been yeah. in the Jacksons. You know how we get down, baby. True, true. Nas, true. Nas. What is it? What is it, baby? What is it, son? What is it, baby? What is it, baby? What is it, man? You know what I'm saying? Niggas don't listen, man. Representing is ill, Maddie. Maddie, Maddie, Maddie. Yeah. Straight out the fucking dungeons of rap Where fake niggas don't make it back I, I recognize this Rappers are monkey flipping with the funky rhythm I be kicking, musician, inflicting composition A pain, I'm like Scarface, sniffing cocaine Holding the M16, see with the pen I'm extreme Now, niggas be running through the block shooting Time to start the revolution, catch a body half for Houston Once they caught us off guard, the Mac-10 was in the grass And I ran like a cheetah with thoughts of an assassin Picked the Mac up, told brothers back up The Mac spit, lead was hitting niggas One ran, I made a backflip Heard a few chicks scream, my arm I'm shook, couldn't look, gave another squeeze, heard it click, yo my shit is stuck, oh, tried shit. to cock it, it wouldn't shoot, now I'm in danger, finally pulled it back and saw three bullets caught up in the chamber, so now I'm jetting to the building lobby, and it was full of children, probably couldn't see as high as I be, <laughs> it's like the game ain't the same, got younger niggas pulling the triggers, bringing fame to their name, and claim some corners, crews without guns or corners, in broad daylight, stick up kids, they run up on us, folks, you gotta slide on a vacation, inside information, it keeps large niggas erasing and they wild spacing It drops deep as it does in my breath I never sleep, huh? cause sleep is the cousin of death Beyond the walls of intelligence, life is defined I think of crime when I'm in a New York state of mind New York state of mind Such a good beat Yeah That I'm a gangster, drinking my wet, holding text, making sure the cash came correct. Then I step 
investments in stock Sewing up the box to sell rocks Winning gunfights with mega cops But just a nigga Walking with his finger on the trigger Make enough figures until my pockets get bigger I ain't the type of brother made for you to start testing Give me a Smith and Wesson, I have niggas undressing Lamp like Capone, with truck strips on All the legal luxury life, rings flooded with stones Homes, I got so many rhymes, I don't think I'm too sane Life is parallel to hell, but I must maintain It be prosperous, though we live dangerous Cops could just arrest me, blaming us We're held like hostages It's only right that I was born to use mics And the stuff that I write is even tougher than dice I'm taking rappers to a new plateau Do rap slow, my rhyming is a vitamin Hell without a capsule The smooth criminal on beat breaks Never put me in your box if your shit eats tape The city never sleeps, full of villains and creeps That's where I learned to do my hustle, had to scuffle with freaks I'm an addict for sneakers, 20s of Buddha and bitches with beepers In the streets I could reach her, about plants I teach her And held deep like the words of my breath I never sleep, cause sleep is the cousin of death I lay back I really love that beat, but I'm sure I know it. Hmm. But is there a version without the lyrics on it? Uh, uh, no. <laughs> that was great. Yeah. That was a lot. Like, he just kept going. Yeah. 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 It's never ending flow. And he's only 19. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah. That was just a cool vibe. Mm -hmm. I really liked that. When I was saying he just kept going and going and going, I was like, how many rhymes can one man make and it wasn't it wasn't they weren't obvious mm -hmm. it was like words that were totally different to each other but yeah. the way he said them there was a line in particular prosperous dangerous yeah so those were like okay like they're kind of not obvious but they're yeah. like obvious rhymes but then when he said the way he said blaming us it rhymed with dangerous and, yeah. and prosperous. Yeah. And then hostages. He just kept going and going and going and going and going. I feel like there were so many lines out, like so many, so much rhyming and stuff that sometimes it was hard for me to absorb what was going on. Right. Um, but I loved it. And it also has a legendary line, which is, uh, I never sleep because sleep is the cousin of death. You know, I was going to tell you that was my favorite line. A few other rappers have kind of like, kind of tried to replicate that line mm -hmm. or kind of like use the same reference. I know like Lil Wayne and Kendrick have both mm -hmm. kind of used it. So that was produced by uh, DJ Premier. So mm -hmm. he's a legendary producer. Um, he's part of a rap group called Gangstar. Mm -hmm. uh, Seth Rogen likes Gangstar, just just so you know. That's my hero. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, this this is like a quintessential Nas song. So people would say like this is the, if there was like one Nas song to like know, most people would probably say this. That was a um, great song. Yeah. And the vibe was very New York. So we'll move on to track two, which is called uh, Life's a Bitch featuring AZ. So AZ is actually the only featured rapper on this album. I feel like this was his introduction to the world. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah. Okay. Hey yo, what's up, what's up, let's keep it real, son. Count this money, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Hey yo, put the grass over there in the sand. That's really you know smooth. Yeah, yeah. Jackson's. The Washington's go to white, so you know how that go. I'm saying that's what this is all about, right? Clothes, bank rolls, and hoes, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yo, then what, man? What? 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 Visualizing the realism of life and actuality Fuck who's the baddest, the person's status depends on salary And my mentality is money orientated I'm destined to live the dream for all my peeps who never made it Cause shit, yeah, we were beginners in the hood as five percenters But something must have got in us cause all of us turned to sinners Now some mm -hmm. resting in peace and some are sitting in San Quentin Others such as myself are trying to carry on tradition Even though we know somehow we all gotta go But as long as we leave and even we'll be leaving with some kind of dose So mm -hmm. into that day we expire and turn to vapors Me and my cape I'll be somewhere stacking plenty papers Keeping it real, packing, still getting high Cause life's a bitch and then you die <laughs> Life's a bitch and then you die That's why we get high Cause you never know when you're gonna go Life's a bitch and then you die That's why we puff lie I woke up early on my born day I'm 20 as a blessing The essence of adolescence Leaves my body now freshen My physical frame is celebrated Cause I made it One quarter through life Some garlic like thing created Got rhymes 365 days annual plus some Load up the mic and bust one Cuss while I puss from My skull cause it's pain And my brain vein Money maintained No more against the brain Simple and plain When I was younger This I used to do my thing hard Robbing 
foreigners take their wallets, they jewels, and rip their green cards. Now it's all about cash and abundance. Niggas I used to run with is rich or doing years in the hundreds. Oh, I switched wow. my motto. Instead of saying fuck tomorrow, that buck that bought a bottle could have struck the lotto. Once I stood on the block, loose tracks, produce stacks. I cooked up and cut small pieces to get my loot back. Time is ill-matic, keep static like wool fabric. Pack a formatic to crack your whole cabbage. Life's a bitch and then you die. So that's his dad. Oh, no way. Sophia. I feel like with these songs, if you just put them on and listen to them without lyrics, you'd be like, yeah, this sounds cool. This is a yeah. good vibe. But when you're like reading the lyrics, first of all, he just rhymes and rhymes and rhymes and, yeah. rhymes, and rhymes and rhymes and rhymes. He also goes pretty fast. So sometimes I am yeah, yeah, finding yeah. it hard to keep up. <laughs> But then I'm like, I just, I'm hearing all these rhymes and I'm like, Jesus Christ, even when I don't understand what he's talking about, because yeah. there are like metaphors, I'm just like, how are you doing this? Mm -hmm. Like, and the ones, the, the ones where it's, like I said, he, he, it's not an obvious rhyme. It's two words that are totally different or like, like, for example, bust one, pus, but he, he pronounced pus from, from, like yeah. from. Yeah. Those are two totally different sets of words, but he makes them right. Yeah, yeah. And so he had bust, cuss, pus, but then he had the one and then the from. Yeah. Oof. And then <laughs> pain in my brain vein, money maintained, don't go against the grain, simple and plain. Yeah. He just keeps going. Exactly. Yeah. So he's he's kind of a master here on Nilmatic, especially like the internal rhyme scheme. So mm -hmm. like rhyming different words just on the same line. I think... I think uh, people would say like Big Daddy Kane. He's he's a rapper that kind of. I think he started from the eighties, late eighties, I believe, or mid eighties. Big Daddy Kane. He was doing a lot of internal rhyme schemes, and then I mean now you've heard MF Doom. Yeah, so, yeah, 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 yeah. Because I guess because we've not listened to a lot of like older rap. Yeah. And I feel like I don't know how to explain it. Like the Raymond schemes, they're much more similar to like Mad Villainy. Like yeah. The ones like the newer stuff we've been listening to. Not that it's less lyrical. I feel like it's just lyrical in a different way. Yeah. This is heavily. Like, yeah. This is packed. So the thing is, like, as you can tell too from the beats, it's uh, it's more simple. Mm -hmm. It's more of a vibe. Whereas like now you can. You know, artists take advantage of like the mixing. Yeah, and and they make it part of the mm, the experience. Yeah, the experience exactly. But they don't really have that. Yeah. I feel like they're having like right. sometimes. I I think sometimes an album like rap can be really good based solely on the vibe and the production. Yeah, yeah. and that's not a hit at anything. That's right. It's solely, just different. It's just different. Yeah, and it's an ex different experience. Yeah. but this because it's simple like it's a vibe but yeah. what's really holding it is what he's seeing yeah and it's amazing it's so impressive yeah so like in the 90s the the emphasis is the rhyming mm -hmm. like that was that was just a culture like you had to be better than you than the next guy like mm -hmm. you had to really rap and so that's why you see a lot of the old heads like me <laughs> um not as much anymore because i really appreciate all music now mm -hmm. Um, but a lot of the old heads would be like, well, you know, this new guy, he's not rapping like this. Mm -hmm. Like there's the lyrics are not there. Mm -hmm. That's kind of what's being sacrificed now for the just for the overall sound. It's more about the vibe. And that's cool. And that's like fine. that's what the, like, that's, yeah. that's totally fine. But wow. back in the 90s, like you kind of had to make it that way. Like mm -hmm. you had to you had to out rap everybody else. Mm -hmm. So you can't really base it on like the like exactly. The yeah. Like you don't get cool panning or also the first verse by AZ. Mm hmm. Um, I remember when I was younger, I was like looking at magazines and they would name that as one of the best verses of all time. Oh, wow. Yeah. Alou Dara is actually Nas's dad. Mm -hmm. He played oh. the, yeah, he played the horns. Yeah, that was so cool. Yeah, he played the horn. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he's a jazz musician. Wow. He was a jazz musician. Yeah. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah. So, um. That must be nice having your dad on your own. Exactly. Yeah. yeah so, music um. With your dad. So he grew up, he grew up with a musician. Yeah. So. Great. And that was produced by L.E.S. So that was a nice smooth beat. Mm -hmm, that was very smooth. A great sample. So we'll move on to track four, which is uh, the song that you know called oh, The World Is Yours. Yeah, this is this produced by uh, the legendary Pete Rock, who mm -hmm. I will talk about after okay. the song. It's yours. Whose world is this? The world is yours. 
the world is yours. I sip the dumb peak, watching Gandhi till I'm charged and writing in my book of rhymes. All the words past the margin, the whole of mic I'm throbbing. Mechanical movement, understandable smooth shit that murderers move with. The thief's theme, play me at night, they won't act right. The fiend of hip hop has got me stuck like a crack pipe. A cruising in a six cab, a Montero Jeep, I can't call it. The beats make me falling asleep, I keep falling, but never falling six feet deep. I'm out for presidents to represent me. Say what? I'm out for presidents to represent me. Say what? I'm out for dead presidents to represent me. Whose world is this? The world is yours. The world is yours. It's mine, it's mine, it's mine. To my man Ill Will, God bless your life. To my people's throughout Queens, God bless your life. I trip we box of crazy bitches, aiming guns and all my baby pictures. Beef with housing police, release scriptures, that's maybe Hitler's. Yet I'm the mild money getting style, rolling foul. The versatile honey sticking wild, golden child dwelling in the rotten apple. You get tackled, a court by the devil's lasso. Shit is a hassle. There's no days for both days. We sell a smoke pays while all the old folks pray. The Jesus soaking they sins and trays. A holy water, odds against nods and slaughter. Think of the word best describing my life. To name my daughter, my strength. My son, the star, will be my resurrection. Oh, yeah. Born in correction, all the wrong shit I did. He'll lead in right direction. How you live in larger broker, charge cards are mediocre. You flipping coca, playing spit spades and strip poker. City banded, hold myself down single handed for murder raps. I kick my thoughts alone, get remanded. Born alone, die alone. No clue to keep my crown of thorn. I'm deep, I sound alone. Cave inside a thousand miles from home. I need a new nigga for this black cloud to follow. Cause while it's over me, it's too dark to see tomorrow. Trying to maintain, I flip, feel the clip to the tip. Picturing my peeps, now the end can make my heartbeat skip. And I'm amped up, they like the champ up. Even my brains in handcuffs. It's yours, it's yours. It's mine, it's mine, it's mine. The world is yours. The world is yours. I already know that one, mm -hmm. as we discussed. I love the vibe. I yeah. think it's a really cool song. I didn't know any of the words except the world is yours. The chorus. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Again, I don't want to. I don't want to just keep saying this after every song, but he really just keeps going and going and going and going and going, yeah. and, going and going. It's amazing. Yeah. And I feel like I don't know if I've made this comparison before. You know how everybody can color grade video now, and like Netflix can make a shitty like production and yeah, make it look good. Though. It looks immaculate, so everyone's yeah, yeah. like, "Oh shit, this is a vibe." Right. But it's actually like it has no substance. Mm -hmm. I feel like some music today is like that. And this is like an old film that holds up because it's such a good film. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because the storyline is so good and you, you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. I totally know what you mean. Yeah. That one was produced by Pete Rock, who was on the mm -hmm. on the hook there. Mm -hmm. So Pete Rock is a, as I said before, he's a legendary producer. Uh, most of his records in the beginning was with a rapper called CL Smooth. Mm -hmm. So he was producing, he produced those albums with him. They were like a duo. And uh, I, I used to listen to them a lot. University days. There was a certain point in high school where I just I really liked um, jazzy samples. I, I liked hearing the horns. Of course, that's another classic song, as you yeah. said. And, yeah, um, that's a great song. Uh, that's another one that people would say is like one of their favorites mm -hmm. or a quintessential Nas song. Yeah, the role is yours. So. The, the, it's a really really cool vibe. Yeah, yeah. It's just and a, it's a positive song as well. Yeah. So yeah. Well, we'll move on to track five, which mm -hmm. is called Halftime. Right. Check me out, y'all. Right. Right. Nasty Nas in your area. About to cause mass hysteria Before I blunt, I take out my fronts Then I start the front Matter of fact, I'll be on a manhunt You couldn't catch me in the streets without a ton of reefer That's like Malcolm X catching a jungle fever Nas, why did you do it? You know you got the mad fat fluid when you rhyme It's halftime It's like that You know it's like that I got it him, now you never get the mic back When I attack, there ain't an army that can strike back So I react never calmly on a hype track I used to hustle, now all I do is relax and strive When I was young, I was a fan of the Jackson 5 I drop jewels, wear jewels, hope to never run it With more kicks than a baby in a mother's stomach Nasty knives, has to rise, can surprise This is exercise till the microphone dies But not bisexual, I'm an intellectual A rap, I'm a professional, and that's no question, yo And next time I run I'll be foul whenever I freestyle. I see trial niggas say I'm wow. I need a rhyme, fight as rhyme. Stay tuned, I assume the real rap comes at halftime. I got it going on, even flip them on his song every after. 
afternoon, I kick half the tune. And in the darkness, I'm heartless like when the narcs hit word the Marcus Garvey, a heartless spark. I won't plant seeds, don't need an extra mouth, I can't feed. That's extra Philly change, more cash for damp weed. This goes out to Manhattan, the Allen of Staten. Brooklyn and Queens is living fat in the boogie down. Enough props, enough clout. Yeah, we'll rest in peace, yo, I'm out. You said one of your favorite Nas lines of all time. Don't tell me what it is. I'm gonna guess. Okay. More kicks than a baby <laughs> in a mother's stomach. Yes. <laughs> you know. Archie if you, has if you know, you a know. wall, an, a wall of boxes of sneakers. It's a, it's a problem. It's an addiction. This reminds me of Mad Villainy in that the vibe is so good. I'm really enjoying the vibe. Mm -hmm. I'm trying so hard to keep up with what he's saying <laughs> and I can't. That's okay. I know it's okay, but yeah, I'm yeah, still yeah. really enjoying it. And right. I'm still like trying to catch on to things. And when I do catch on to something, I'm like, oh my God, that's so funny. Yeah. Um, but I feel like because with Mad Villainy, I, I like at the time, and I got criticized for that because I wasn't trying to break down the lyrics. Yeah. I can't. It, like, right? Unless we want to make this video four hours long. Yeah. I simply cannot. I feel like these, I feel like there's so much to unpack. Like there's so much in such a short, Right. it's impossible. There's so much to unpack, but in a way like that's, that's a good thing because as you go back to it, you're going to yeah, catch it, it, more it and more you things. Yeah. yeah. You're going to be like, oh shit. Like with yeah. Manvillini, there's stuff that now I'm like, oh, I didn't, I didn't catch that before. Right. For sure. Like, I guess if you're not used to like listening to this kind of rap, mm -hmm. Um, and again, everybody has listened, no, people who have listened to this album have listened to it for the first time at one point. Mm -hmm. So for it's like my villain. Yeah, yeah. So it's not like you're going to get everything on first yeah, listen. I think it's impossible to get yeah. everything. And I, I think and again, it's actually a yeah. testament to, to the lyricism that you don't catch on to everything yeah. immediately because it's so complicated and it takes a lot of talent to do that. Right. All right. Move on to track number six, which is called Memory Lane. Mm -hmm. Fuck that shit, word, word, fuck that other shit. I rap for listeners, blunt heads, fly ladies and prisoners, Hennessy holders and old school niggas, then I be dissing them, unofficials that mo' wooly tie. I dropped out of coolie high, gas the vibe, coquette, cutie pie, jungle survivor, fuck who's the lava. My man put the battery in my back, a difference from energizer, sentence begins to dent it. With formality, moderation's infinite, money wise a physiology. It's real, grew up in tripe life, the times of white lines, the high pipes, murderous night times, the night fights and bright crimes. Chill on the block with cardiac co strap, with my Peace that's in the drug money market interact Peace God Peace God Now the shit is explained I'm taking niggas on a trip Straight through memory lane It's like that y'all It's like that y'all It's like that One for the money, two for a pussy and foreign cars Three for Alize, niggas deceased or behind bars I rap the vanguard, check that prognosis Is it real or showbiz? My window faces, shootouts, drug overdoses Live amongst the roses, only the drama For real, a nickel plate is my fate My medicine is the ganja And yo, fuck rappers, real, watch the herbs stand still Never talking to snakes, cause the words a man kill True in the game, as long as blood is blue in my vein I pull my Heineken brew to my deceased crew in memory lane I, I feel like I, I don't have much to say because I keep just saying the same thing. I'm just enjoying how it sounds yeah. and trying to follow along with what he's saying. Yeah, no, for and sure. I'm just impressed by how he's rhyming. Right. Um, he's so intelligent. Yeah. And again, like he's 19 when he made yeah. this. Like it's it's pretty it's pretty insane. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's it's incredible. Cool. Um, yeah, I'm just enjoying it. I feel bad because I'm not like during the song. I'm trying to focus because I I can passively just enjoy the yeah, vibe, yeah, yeah. which I'm really enjoying. But I have to really actively focus on um, what he's actually seeing. I guess along with Mad Villainy, mm -hmm. it's probably the most lyrical yeah. thing you would you we've reacted to we i guess so. like i don't want to say that like you know kendrick and, and j cole are not lyrical yeah, at all they are it's they, just very they different really are. it's just yeah. in a very different way yeah. i feel like i feel like um with for example kendrick i and j cole I, f I feel like they're super lyrical but sometimes it's more obvious what they're talking about yeah we're more direct so track number seven is called one love and is featuring q-tip mm -hmm. so q-tip is a uh, 
from a shop called Quest. He produced this and he's on the he's on the hook as well. Okay, so, cool. This next one is called One Love. Yo, this is what I got from my man Nas, man. Where was born? What it say, kid? What up, kid? I know shit is rough doing your bit. When the cops came, you should have slid to my crib. Fuck it, like the time for looking back is done. Plus, congratulations, you know you got a son. I heard he looks like you. Why don't your lady write you? Told her she should visit, that's when she got hyper. I left for half a hundred in your commissary. You was my nigga when push came to shove. One what? One love. One love. One love. One love. One love. Stay strong Out in New York The same shit is going on The crackhead's talking Loud mouths is talking Ho, check out the story Yesterday when I was walking That nigga you shot last year Try to appear like he hurt something Word him up I heard him fronting And he be pumping on your block Your man gave him your block And now they run together What up son, whatever Last time you wrote You said they tried you in the showers But maintain when you come home The corner's hours on the reels All these crap niggas know the deal When we start the revolution All they probably do is squeal So stay simple Last time flies, no incarcerated your mind dies. I hate it when your mom's cries. It kinda makes me wanna murder. For real, I even got a mask and gloves to bust slugs for one love. One love, one love, one love, one love. Sometimes I sit back with a Buddha sack, minds in another world, thinking how could we exist through the facts, written in school textbooks, Bibles, etc. Fuck a school lecture, the lies get me vexed up. Oh. So I be ghost for my projects. I take my pen and pad for the weekend, hitting nails while I'm sleeping. A two day stay, you may say I needed time alone to relax my dome. No phone left and not at home. I took the L when he passed it. This little bastard keeps me blasted. It starts talking mad shit. I had to school him, told him don't let niggas fool him. Cause when the pistol blows, the one that's murder be the cool one. Shorty's laugh was cold blooded as he spoke so foul. Only 12 trying to tell me that he liked my style. Then I rose, wiping the blunt's ass from my clothes and froze. Only to blow the earth smoke through my nose and told my little man I'm a ghost. I bros left some jewels in his skull that he could sell if he chose. Words of wisdom from Nas try to rise up above. Keep an eye out for Jake. Shorty, rock one love. So I think a lot has been going over in my head so far because it's so packed full of things. <laughs> yeah. But this one I kind of got that these people are in jail. Or the first two verses, it's yeah. people in jail. Right. Because I understood, um, like, uh, congratulations, you know you got a son. And then, why don't your lady write you? I understood that that is the reason in the letter. Yeah. He's giving them information, what's going on <laughs> outside. Yes. Yeah. And then in the second one, dear born, you'll be out soon. And then, um, last time you wrote, you said they tried you in the showers. <laughs> Definitely a jail thing. Yes. And then also, though incarcerated, your mind dies. I hate when your mom's cry, etc. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got, he, they're in jail. Right. The third verse, I don't, like, he's not, it's not someone in jail here, right? No, he's just kind of rapping in general now. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's good. Yeah. I like when he, like, he, like, rhymes, and then you think it's over. But it's not because he like going. does another line yeah but then after that line he throws in like he goes back to the rhyme that he was doing right. before yeah, yeah yeah yeah. i think that's really clever we'll move on to uh one time for your mind track and read yeah it's ilmatic yeah one time for your mind one time at your nine what up Paul? Pick that fucking rhyme check it out when I'm chillin', I grab the Buddha, get my food up by beers and watch a flick, illin' and root for the villain, huh? After being blessed by the herb's essence, what? I'm back to my rest, <laughs> ten minutes, some odd seconds. Yeah. That's where I got the honey at, spends the night for sexin'. Uh -huh. Keep lubrication, what? lifestyle protection, uh -huh. try to stay mellow rock. Well, I could fill a rhymes that make me richer than a slipper what? made Cinderella fella. <laughs> Over rocking microphones and twisting off a 40 top. Yeah. One time for your mind, one time. But kick that for them gangsters, man. Fuck all that, man. Right, right. What up, niggas? How y'all is nasty, the villain? I'm still writing rhymes, but besides that, I'm chilling. I'm trying to get this money, God. You know the hard times, kid. Shit, Kobe starving, make you want to do crimes, kid. But now 
now I know the time Got an older mind plus control a nine Fine, see now I represent mine I'm new on the rap scene Brothers never heard of me Yet I'm a menace, yo Police wanna murder me Mighty dog drinker Represent the thinker My pen rides the paper It even has blinkers Never plan to stop When I write my hand is hot And expand a lot From the whiz the Camelot The parlayer I make your heads bop paw I shine a light on perpetrators Like a cop's car From day to night I play the mic and you'll thank God I wreck shit so much The microphone and need a big job From 92 to 99 after being blessed by the herb's essence, I'm back to my rest <laughs> 10 minutes, some odd seconds. Yeah. That's where I got the honey at. Spends the night for sex and keep lubrication, lifestyle protection. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that one was a bit easier to catch because it's it was slower paced. Yeah, it felt more like thing. a. That's the thing with with this with this kind of rap. I feel like there's so much and 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 it goes it goes by really quickly. Yeah. So by the time I've like caught on, if I like try and focus on something. Yeah. I'm like, okay, he did this. He did. What does this all mean? If I'm concentrating on that, by the time I've worked out, we're already eight more lines ahead. Yeah, so yeah, I've yeah. just missed everything that goes on in between. Right. Yeah. So I'm I can't I can't spend too long trying to work out one line. But because that was slower paced, I was yeah. able to to absorb more, which was good. All right, we'll just keep moving on. Mm -hmm. Okay, number nine is called represent. represent, represent. in the jungle get murdered on the humble guns of last niggas tumble the corners is the hot spot full of mad like women who don't care <laughs> guzzling bears we all stare at the out of town hey, they better that. break north before we get the four pounders and take their face off the streets is filled with undercovers homicide chasing brothers the d's on the roof trying to watch us and knock us Nas is a rebel of the street corner pulling a check out the dresser police got me under pressure, pressure. Represent, on the corner rolling up less when i dress is never nothing less than guests kobe walking with a pop and my hat turned back huh? love committing sins and my friends sell crap this nigga raps with a razor keep it under my tongue the school dropout never like this shit from day one because like the brutalizer brutalizer accelerator the type of nigga who be pissing in your elevator somehow the rap game reminds me of the crack game used to sport valleys and gazelles with black frames now i'm into fat chain sex and sex fly new chicks and new kicks heinies and This is what it's about Before the BDP conflict with MC Shan Around the time with Shantae Just the real rocks in I used to wake up every morning See my crew on the block Every day's a different plan that had us running from cops If it wasn't hanging out in front of cocaine spots We was at the candy factory Breaking the locks Nowadays I need the green and the flash Just like the next man Fuck a yard guard Let me see a hundred grand Represent y'all Living a real fucking life oh, and every projects man. all over. Too much ass niggas, bitch ass niggas, Yo, bitch ass motherfucker. Come to Queen Bread, motherfucker. I'm not your legal type of fella. <laughs> yeah, he was Marijuana at the candy smoking street dweller. Yeah, he was at the candy factory breaking the locks. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah. There was a the line before that. Yeah, if it wasn't hanging out in front of cocaine spots, we was at the candy factory breaking the locks. Yeah, yeah I understood. He's saying about doing illegal things. Yeah, survival mode. He's uh he's not your legal type. Felt. Right. Very inviting as well. Come to Queen, Queensbridge MF at the end there. Uh, <laughs> How kind. <laughs> yeah. Sweet. Yeah. Um, yeah, I really yeah. like that beat also. Yeah, that yeah. was by DJ Premier also. Yeah, I really like that. Yeah, he did, uh, he did the three tracks there. He produced um, New York State of Mind, Memory Lane, and Represent. Okay, well, we've made it to the end here. Mm -hmm. uh, track number 10 is called It Ain't Hard to Tell. Human nature? Yeah. <laughs> Cause in my physical I can't express through song Delete stress like Motrin then extend strong 
tongue. I drink my wet with Medusa, give a shotguns in hell. From the split that I lift and in hell, it ain't hard to tell. The Buddha monks in your trunk, turn the bass up. Not stories by Aesop. Place your loot up, parties I shoot up. Nas are analyzed, drop a jewel. In hell from the L, school of full well. You're feeling like Grell, it ain't hard to tell. I kick a skill like Shaquille, hoes a pill. Vocabulary spills, I'm ill. Plus, Matic, I freak beat, slam it like Iron Sheik. Jam like a tech with correct techniques. Rhythmatic explosion is what your frame of mind is chosen. I leave your brain stimulated. Niggas is frozen. Speak with criminal slang, begin like a violin. And like Nevaya Thin is deep, well let me try again Wisdom be leaking out my grateful truth I dominate break loops, giving Mike's ministry cycles Streets <laughs> disciple, I rock beats this mega trifle And groove even smoother than moves by Villanova You're still a soldier, I'm like Sly Stone and Cobra Packing like a roster in the weed spot Vocals are squeeze glocks, and CZs drop Though they need not to sneak My poetry's deep, I never fell Nas's rap should be locked in a cell <laughs> It ain't hard to it tell, hard to tell. That was a really nice sample. Yeah. That's my favorite Michael Jackson song. That's, Is it really? Yeah. Wow, I didn't know that. Yeah, I love that song. That's, that was very nice. nice. I really liked that. Yeah, that's definitely one of my favorite beats for yeah, sure. that was one, really one, nice. One of my favorite to, songs really on the album. To end the album. Yeah. I, I, I want to apologize for not being able to. <laughs> you to, to apologize. To not, for not being able to break no. down the words and the... Hey, you got to keep it real. Yeah. We got to keep I'm it real on the to, channel. To keep it real. So. I'm not going to sit here for 20 minutes in between each song like working out what i'm gonna yeah. say breaking down the lyrics i can't this is my first reaction right i really loved it i really liked the vibe i i i loved like he, he's obviously incredibly clever he, mm -hmm. he's very very good at like rhyming structures and i was very impressed by that i just i can't possibly break down what everything means no for on, sure on first listen yeah. i will be going back to this definitely um, and I hope to be able to work out what more of it means. But yeah, I, I really love that. He's incredibly talented. And I, I just really enjoy, like the sound is really cool. It's a yeah. really, I don't know, it's a really kind of laid back, cool. And I think it matches also a lot of what he's talking about. You right? feel like you're in New York. Yeah. But also it kind of it kind of transports you back because it's obviously a different kind of New York mm -hmm, now mm -hmm. um, in 2024. Yeah, definitely. Um, wow. So that was like... Uh, 2024 it's so like, that's like 30 years ago it's 30 years ago yeah Jeez. wow that's actually quite impressive yeah because it's still so good yeah it holds up for sure all of this like i said we've we've said throughout the videos from the from the perspective of like a 19 year old mm. um kind of growing up in the projects trying to just survive trying mm -hmm. to make it and the fact that he's he's kind of made it out there mm -hmm. by rhyming like this and yeah yeah that's pretty amazing yeah yeah but yeah i i love that i thought it yeah. was i I want to give the highest respect to the lyricism, but I thought the vibe was great. It's just yeah. a really nice, relaxed, laid back vibe. Mm -hmm. I could listen to this without the lyrics and still be impressed yeah, for sure. and still enjoy it. I think that's important too. So yeah, yeah. I really enjoyed it. Five and, nights. Uh, <laughs> it's inspired like so many other rappers. Like I know people like Schoolboy Q, J. Cole, uh, Danny Brown. They've all said that Nas is their favorite rapper. Kanye's said that as well. I can understand why. Like, yeah. I think he's fantastic. I think he's yeah. insanely intelligent. All right, so that wraps up our review. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you guys for watching. If you made thank it this far, so as always, stay tuned. We got got a lot lined up. Mm -hmm. You know, we, we we read your comments, we see your requests, and uh, we will get to them. Mm -hmm. Like, it's just uh, it's hard to just kind of like say this one's first, this one's first. Mm -hmm. Like, it just kind of we just kind of go with how we feel at the time. But yeah, so stay tuned, and mm -hmm. uh, we'll see you next time. Yeah, bye. bye.